Highway 6 between State Highway 93 and 119 still closed this hour as firefighters continue to battle the Goltra fire. Firefighters say it's now burned about 200 acres. Deborah Sevens, uh, Veronica Costa been out near the fire line all day and shares where crews are in their efforts tonight. The Goltra fire has burned just over 200 acres. Highway 6 here behind me still closed at the Clear Creek Canyon. And those water and air fighting resources, those have been here. Those are helping the firefight as much as they can. We have seen those aerial resources going back and forth, dropping water on the fire as well. As you can imagine, dozens of people were watching from nearby, keeping a close eye on this one. The Jefferson County Sheriff's Office telling us they are certain it was started by a lightning strike. That's based off witness accounts. Now, along with those aerial resources, the Sheriff's Office says 65 firefighters are helping try to put this out. They are coming from West Metro Fire, Arvada, Golden Fire as well. A whole lot of other departments too. Well, when help the fire spread on Tuesday night into Wednesday morning, officials tell us they are in a good spot right now. They also say the fact that there are no other nearby fires have really helped them. They feel like they aren't competing for resources right now. We're hopeful. Um, we're, we're not competing the way that we were a couple of weeks ago, which is a good thing. Officials also telling us trees and brush are burning right now. There are no homes in the line of the fire, and that is great news. In Jefferson County, I'm Veronica Acosta, Denver 7. Thank you, Veronica. As firefighters battle yet another wildfire, they're reminding people not to fly drones above the burn zone. The National Interagency Fire Center says 16 drones have been flown illegally so far this year, including two in Colorado. Eight of those incursions caused aerial firefighting efforts to ground. When you fly, they can't.